Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax, the channel that's here to help you figure out how to build your dream garage. And today we're going over how to file a tool exchange from Sonic Tools. So let's jump right into it. So if you're new to the channel, thanks for stopping by. Be sure to hit that like and subscribe button if you like my content. And if you're a long time subscriber, always good to have your back. Just want to let you know I'm still running the July giveaway where you could win a $100 Amazon gift card. So be sure to check that out in the link below. So today's video is going to be quick and simple because the process is quick and simple. If you haven't watched my last video about reviewing my Sonic tools, be sure to check that out. But if you already have Sonic tools and one of them happened to break, here's the procedure on how to claim your 24 hour exchange tool. So a while ago, it took me a while to get this video done. I made some ice ties for my race car. Uh, they are tedious, terrible and hard to make, very challenging. And unfortunately, the tools that broke all happened during that one project. It took me about four days to make these tires. So I'll show you one tool and then I'm going to show you how to file the exchange on both a cell phone and a computer. So first off, I was installing 140 plus snowmobile studs into my tires. So a lot of drilling and a lot of talking down the actual studs. So two bits that broke are my T25 bit. The head snapped right off of it. So I'm going to show you how to do a warranty claim on a cell phone. So check it out. When you get to Sonic's website, bottom right, you'll see more. Hit that button, hit the 24 hour tool exchange, go down there, enter your name, um, your email address, your phone number, your physical address. I'm skipping that. And then you'll get to the section where it says reason for return. You can see I put down the tip of my T25 bit snapped off. Be sure you get your order number um, handy because you need that. You put that down. Good thing about Sonic Tools is every part has the part number on the actual tool. So enter in that. And then from that, you're going to have to select two photos. They want two photos of what the tool is. So this is what it looks like when you're using a phone. You just go into your photo roll. Choose one photo per section there. You can put multiple photos per section, but it requires you to put one photo per section. Once you've chosen your two photos, you can not have your tools custom etched, but I don't have that. Just hit no and then hit submit. So as you can see guys, quick, simple, very harmless. Let's see what they have to say. Now the next tool that broke, some of the holes I drilled needed to file out a bit more because there is metal in tires. So I was using my circular file, but a tire is very sticky. Uh, I bought brand new snow tires, so that uh, made this very sticky and this snapped off. So I've submitted this. I'm going to show you how to submit a claim on a computer now. Basically the same, but I'm just going to show you. So same process, sonictools.com. Go to the 24 hour tool exchange, enter your name and address. It looks identical. You just put down the reason for uh, your claim here. And I'm saying it's the filing tip snapped off. You put down your order number, you put down the tool number, and then you select two photos. So when you're selecting these two photos, you can simply just drag and drop them. You don't have to uh, hit choose file. So that's nice. Dragging and dropping is the best. Again, I don't have anything etched, so I hit no. And I'm not a robot and I hit submit. So guys, as you can tell, filing a warranty claim is quick and simple. I will do another video on any communication I get with them and how the tools arrive and how quickly they arrive. So until next time, thanks a lot for stopping by and I'll see you then.